Well, a lot of kids went home with a lot of eggs after today's Easter egg hunt at the Southside Community Resource Center in Oroville. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper spoke with the community about what today's event meant to them. Don't run me over. <laughs> <laughs> I was just praying that they didn't run me over. They were, they were strong little kids. About 250 kids came down to the Southside Orville Community Center for food, fun, and about 2,000 Easter eggs. Facilities manager Lisa Torres tells me getting everything together was no small feat. It was a prosper. It was long. It took at least at least three or four hours um, in two days. Um, we do have many, we did have many eggs to boil, you know, of course it takes a process, so yeah, but it was fun. You couldn't tell it took that much time. She tells me the community really showed up to make things happen. We had, we had bought some eggs due to donations that we had got around the, the community and plus people brought some eggs that from our church that were already, you know, the cooked. So it was fun to dye them. So we had a little crew going on. I had like the boxing club come up here. Most of the eggs were real with a few plastic ones holding special prizes and a golden egg with a $50 gift card to Tong Fong Lo restaurant. Do you have any plans on what you're going to do with the, the real eggs? Um, maybe cook them and eat them, maybe? You think you're going to eat them? Awesome. Yeah. Do you guys like eggs a lot? Or? Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. yeah, we always like eggs when they're cooking. For volunteers, the event was also exciting, but also a little chaotic. It was kind of overwhelming, to be honest. Some of them just came up and started asking. I was like, come on, it's an egg hunt. Y'all yeah. supposed to go get them. Yeah. So I just kind of just tossed them out to everybody. Yeah, that, it was like they was wrestling each other, you know. I just I just kept on throwing it. Oh, this was like the best year. I just like to see the other kids be happy, you know. Besides egg hunting, kids also got to look forward to temporary tattoos and a bounce house. How much fun are you having here? What What's it been like for you today? A good time and I like it because some of these people that I know is from school. I hope everybody has a happy Easter. Torres tells me with an event this big, none of it would have been possible without so much help from the community, donating their eggs, donating their time, and now a lot of kids get to go home and eat those eggs for Easter morning and have memories for a lifetime. I'm Lauren Cooper reporting in Oroville with Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. And that egg hunt started around noon today and little kids got to be in the front so they could have a better chance of getting some of their eggs in their basket.